So what we're going to do is to run through a series of methodologies that were created mainly in the 1900s that adopted the idea that language learning should be much more communicative, much more natural. The first one is called audiolingualism and it's also called the army method because of where it was developed. Basically, psychology during the 1950s and 60s was building up new theories about behaviorism. Perhaps the most famous experiments that were done in this particular area were by Pavlov where he was showing that most animals undergo a stimulus response mechanism and he had a, a series of famous experiments where by ringing a bell he could cause a dog to salivate that would be his response in the expectation of getting some food. This behaviourist idea of stimulus response was put into an actual teaching methodology. Basically, in the audio-lingualism method, these two parts of the name tell us what actually happens. Audio is to listen, and lingual is to repeat. So what we do is a series of drills. And these intensive verbal drills help us to get a use of the particular language. So let's take an example of what those drills might involve. So here is an example of a repetition drill. I will model the language and then my class will repeat after me. So. This is a cup. This is a cup. This is a cup. This is a cup. Spoon. This is a spoon. This is a spoon. This is a spoon. Knife. This is a knife. This is a knife. This is a knife. Thank you.